place right now. Oh, no, we got another no, caution over there. Oh, the ambulance now, your fourth place car with Bo Dragon 2016 collected. Oh, that poor dragon car that was really, dragon. really great. Really. <laughs> That's underway. All right. So now, Patrick, the field is... Four minutes until driver's hand. Four change. minutes until driver's hand. Now the top five is being shook up from second through fifth is getting all mixed up now. We have Are You Greasy, the greasy truck, about to overtake Green Line Stitch in the pits. Remember, this is an endurance race. Missing for 75 minutes. Now we're going to try to get some wheel on stitch. Let me get. Now she's going over here at wheel on stitch pit right now. What has happened with the car? How is it going out there until then? Right now, you're currently in well, fifth place. I think you're falling out. Do you think you can fall back from Arnie Greasy? All right, so we won't stitch as we've done yet. There's welding going on in the steering. That is not open for them. Lots of cars get fixed. Lots of things can happen. Pass it back to you. All right, it's lots of good racing. I still have there to go. Three minutes in the next driver change. Remember, we're racing for 75 minutes, there's less than 18 to go. Looks like our lead racer is going to be just under 150 laps at this current pace. In fact, some of our best racing has been done by Lightning McQueen, who had his best lap of just under 22 seconds, but mostly our leaders are averaging about, 20, uh, about 23 seconds. Well, our slower cars are averaging about 30 seconds. Big caution on the number one. Oh no, what happened there? Everyone's collecting. Are you greasy? Food our lands. Boat Dragon 2016. Oh, there's a lot of damage to the front end there. Are you greasy? It looks like the front wheel is just completely Everyone. busted. Now, Patrick, the camera is like that since day one. <laughs> I think I heard a tire pop too from somebody. I, I thought I heard a tire too. There's been fans of tires popping all day. I don't know what it is. Usually they're loud and you can hear them. And I thought we heard them twice today. I haven't seen anything coming. Oh, and there's a grim penalty going on right now. Who is that? That's... Catastrophe! Your leader! Having to slow dance with the fail whale. Oh, the leader is now slow dancing with the fail whale. This is huge! Oh, now he's done slow dancing. Oh, okay, what a way to dump that whale. You can't dance and quit like that. Oh, no, that caution. Another the caution. Oh, no. The cautions keep on coming. The greasy truck took a bite out of the waffle. Atomic, <laughs> Atomic Chibi having a problem, I too. I didn't know a truck could bite waffles, but it has a mouth. I guess it's Atomic Chibi getting back on the way. There they go. No rest for the wicked, Patrick, I'd say. Cartastrophe almost lost the lead with that uh, that penalty. Was, that was a very close penalty. I want to remind all my teams to not pass under caution. I know you all got the red miss, but it's, you know, be safe, go slow. 30 seconds to driver change, 30 seconds to our last driver change. It'll be a 15 minute sprint to the end of our 75 minute endurance race. Fantastic. Camera two on Fubar Labs. On Fubar Labs, getting out first. 
but they have to go all the way down the line and Cardass Green is going to make it a battery change. Boomer might get out first. Boomer might actually get out before Cartastrophe. Yes, they are. Boomer Lounge is now going to go past Cartastrophe. That puts them on the same lap. Something's wrong with Lucky 13. Oh no, hey, Patrick. Lucky 13. This is it, Patrick. Boomer Labs. Cartastrophe still not moving. Cartastrophe still not moving. Well, Boomer Labs got a put down the heat, Boomer. Oh man. Oh, they're on the same lap now. This is it, folks. First and second, it ain't over. It's never over until the last minute. It is never over in these races. Boomer Labs now hot on the heels of Cartassi, but Cartassi has open air, wide open spaces. No traffic to hold it back. Now it has to put the best laps down it's ever put. In order to hold off Boomer, which just had an amazing pit strategy. Overtaking them, taking the lap back. This is going to be an interesting finish, Patrick. It's going to be real close. Cartastrophe and Fubar right on top of each other. Fubar's got to close the lap, so it is now half the lap to Cartastrophe. We got a lot of other close cars. Macho Man, Atomic TV, Waffle Cart, Pokeball, all very close. 9th, 10th, 11th, 12th. Very close racing, 15th and 14th. Only a lot difference between them. The Rainbow Roadster Blue Blue their car also. On the same lap, Rocket Pot and Pizza Planet also on the same lap. Please Mobile and the Ford GT Le Mans also on the same lap. Gold Dragon, Mario Kart not far behind. <laughs> just, oh, we got more cautions. That's going to hurt Fubar, this caution. That one's really going to hurt Fubar. That is not where they needed to be on this track. Oh, Lightning McQueen is having to be pushed off. Bartashi was on the other end of that caution. <laughs> But now that bunches up the field for Cartastrophe at the other end. This is going to go back and forth, folks. That's right. Because now Fubar is in clean air and Cartastrophe is behind a huge conga line of cars. Fubar blazing down now through turn one trying to catch back up to Cartastrophe. And the field is spinning out and Cartastrophe is fighting its way through. And Fubar has to put down the sauce. It really has to push now. <laughs> Another caution. It's Purpose Corotus. Clear the cars off the track. Corotus. And Lucky 13. Some of the cars have to race. Get them off the track. Or get another buddy. penalty. No waiting. Oh, go or go. He's moving. Don't tell the Grim to wait. He will penalize you. Oh, big question now. What did we say? I'm going to hand a Grim penalty out myself for that. Grims, go get him. Boys, is that Lucky 13? Yeah, could have pulled off the track and said wait, and then he clogged up the entire field. Lucky 13. Give that's... him a grim penalty for that. I think it's, uh, if he comes back out on the track, he's going to have to come back on the track under a grim penalty. Yes. He's going into the pits that might be him. Because I said weekend. so. We only got just over 10 minutes left to race. <laughs> back under green flag racing. That is unfortunate to block the track like that in the middle of this race. Cartas, Green, Puma all on the same lap. Those are the leaders. And a big point boost. The oh, point's a mess now. Oh, complete mess. Look at that four blind going into three and four. I can't believe they made it through there. Oh, man. That was five wide. All hands have to squeeze in on the inside. Five you can't wide. Do this. The really tiny cars just squeezing on through. Like, like getting the last drop of Two-Face out of the Two-Face tube, just a little bit through. You know, roll the tube up and it kind of keeps the screw. I can't believe that happened. All he is active with the tiniest car I've ever seen. Manages to make his way through the hazard car. Yeah, it's smaller than the waffle car, which is already... Oh, Macho Man's pulling in for some reason. Uh, Macho Man. Oh, and Boat Dragon 2016 right in the wall head on. Bojack, what's going on there? I'm not sure what's wrong. Is everything all right? What's with your Pikachu? Everyone's trying to 
fishing on Pokemon or something. Well, you think they try to let Pikachu drive? I don't think Pikachu no. drive. Maybe it's there for extra power. Yeah, if you tell it, you know, Pikachu to drive, but go left. It just says Pikachu. It doesn't really follow along or do anything. It's a wild animal. I can't expect it to drive. As we wind down to the last few moments of this race, I believe the fatigue is starting to set in. Oh no, he's dead again. Yeah, remember he's got a... There we go. It looks like... Yep. Charles won. He's going to incur a penalty there. Just jumping decks or something like that. He's incurring it. Oh. Oh, for breaking down, Charles Bond is dumping a bunch of screws into his drivetrain. That's his penalty for breaking down. He dumped a bunch of screws into his drivetrain. <laughs> I see screws are breaking penalty. down all the time. That's right. The screws are trying to let the screws loose. Here's some more. That was a pretty good penalty there, Charles. Uh, you might recognize Charles from Battle Boss. You might, maybe, a little bit if you watch Battle Boss. That's right. And you he had the over, uh, overhaul. Yep. Is the name of his bot. Oh, yeah. He, he, he's in charge of overhaul. What I like to call him. It's favorite Battle Boss team. Okay. <laughs> Oh no, Bo Dragon again in the wall. I think something's going wrong with the steering of Bo Dragon. Patrick, I'm starting to notice that usually a, a casual observer might think the driving's getting sloppier, but in reality it's the car is getting crappier. The steering's going bad. That's right. The, oh, the rack and pinions, they aren't pinions anymore. No, no, no. It's falling apart. Nothing's left of these machines. And right now, with just seven minutes in this race to go, the clock is ticking for Kardashian and Fubar Labs. Where is Kardashian? Right up there, just going into T1. Fubar Labs now just getting into T1. Black and orange Jeep and Scartastrophe barely hanging on. That green Jeep right there. Fubar Labs about 10 seconds, seconds behind the leader. I think more like, like five seconds. It's really close. It's going to come down to traffic. Who can get by traffic fastest? That's what it's going to come down to. It's what I said at the top of the hour, and it's coming true yet again. Fubar's got a big battle trying to pass all the back markers there. He's doing it definitely. One, two, three, no problem. Yeah, I gotta keep going now. I got Astro trying to get his way to clean here. Not gonna be able to do it this time around. Trying to make his way by Lilo. Lilo helps a little bit by Lilo and Stitch. Yep. But Lilo and Stitch is also back out there after that welding. They're still in it for sixth place. Trying to catch RU Grease in the last few laps. Local area caution, you gotta get that car off the track. Are we good? Are we deep flag? Go, 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 go. Go, deep flag racing. Go, 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 go. Green flag. There we go. Five minutes left, just five minutes left. Patrick, the. It looks like the Pizza Planet car had trouble on the back straight lane. They had to push it all the way back. That's why everyone had to check up. Pizza Planet trying to finish their 70th lap. They're only 21st place. Or no, 20th. Yeah, 21st place. Cartastrophe's right there down the straightaway. Fubar Labs now entering the straightaway. That's right. Fubar Labs is catching them. Fubar Labs is catching them. Oh, man. There are about four cars between them. But Cactaspi has clean air and Fubar does not! It's gonna be close. We're gonna need to get that blue flag out. Man, 
to get that blue flag out for the leaders, for the foot part that had a foo bar, need to let them know that they have a leader behind them.